Okay. So I think I may have found what made Ryder sick. What metal it may have been. Okay. So um, this stand that they've had here a while, it just can't be up there. Um, so it's like an old, I don't know what it is, like a, for a drum kit, symbols or something, stand. And I've started <laughs> wrapping the whole thing with vet wrap. Um, so, oh, I did show making the stand, right? I made this stand a few years ago. Um, and I showed how I put, you know, the, the perches on there and that I painted it purple. Um, so <laughs> what I've started to do is actually put sticky tape around all these legs and I'm going to try and do the whole lot. Um, can we focus please? Sort of. So this um, paint is peeling off and every time a piece of the paint peels off, I don't want to scratch any off because I just don't want it flaking around and all over the place. I mean, it's not worth it for a video to put everyone in danger, um, especially these knobs. This one doesn't look too bad. Um, yeah, but every time a piece of paint flakes off, these ones are horrible. So wrap that one in vet tape, wrap that one in, because you can't see. Wrap that one in vet tape and another one up there. What I believe is with this one in particular, he may have walked across here and used the knob to climb around to the other side. Now he probably didn't ingest the metal and flakes on purpose. Maybe he did, maybe he didn't. Uh, vet wrap is ridiculous and the problem with that is they can climb down I mean it's not super dangerous for them I'm um, guessing the glue and the sticky tape and the sticky tape itself is toxic and gets stuck in their beak and stuck in their crop and stuck in their digestive system um, I want to throw the whole thing away I want to throw it away completely I just need it here for the day until I work out what to do um, and stop the paint flaking off right now I should really throw it away right now I just... Ugh. I know they like to use the stand and it's really good. Um, I don't know, everyone's telling me throw it away, throw it away. What I need you guys to do, um, let's see if I'll put my PayPal link in either to the description or in the comments. Uh, some of my previous videos, especially when Ryder got sick, there's links in those videos to my PayPal to donate. And I did get three people donate money. Um, so I'd love to thank those people. I don't want to name names. I know I should, but I want to. But I'm not going to name names. Three people donated. Um, and I got... I can't remember what it was. Somewhere between, I don't know, like $150 altogether. Um, that was amazing. That was amazing. So that really helped with um, writer's vet bills. I'm going to make another stand. I don't know how much the materials are going to cost me. I'm going to try and get everything free as possible. Then again, free could be bad. You know, I don't want treated woods. Um, I don't want anything contaminated, dirty, moldy, fungus. Uh, so it's best for me to buy all brand new parts and screws and bolts and this and that, stainless steel, rather than using rusty old bolts. Um, this tree here... That one's pretty safe. That's a log in the middle and it's secured to a wooden base and it's got wheels on it. Uh, then we just added a few branches, yada yada, but some seagrass. That one's really good. So I want to do away with the metal and just use as much wood as possible. I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, it could be a lot of money. <laughs> um, yeah. So depending on whether I'm going to use that money that I have at the moment, to make a new bird stand, which could be, I don't know, could be a hundred dollars, could be more, could be more than a hundred dollars worth of materials. Do you want to come matey? Come on, it's a bird video. I need a bird in here. Come on. Oh, it's Sky, sweetie. Sorry, I thought you were your brother because you're scre screeching quite loudly. Come on, sweetie. I got you, boo-boo. Come on, Sky. Come on. Come on. Come on, sweetie. I got you. I got you. Come on. Uh, she's a bit handsome because she's only got the one wing. Yeah, so uh, 
I'm gonna make this place safer for you guys. Yeah. I can hear him. Oh, there he is. Oh, there you are. Hey. <laughs> yeah, that's too good. Yeah. So I guess that's the problem, huh, mate? You didn't probably didn't do it on purpose, hey? And it's probably not your cage. It still could be the cage, but I'm gonna. Say, oh, oh, he's blowing my ear because the guy's on my. Is that sky in my head? Yes, it is. Can you no, you don't get to sit there and bite my ear. Unbelievable, naughty. Okay, and you get to come down because you're a good girl. Don't climb to my shoulder. Sippy lala, you just want to give me kisses. Come here and give me kisses then. There you go. There you go. Just give him an alternate <laughs> option. That's just as good, right? No, we're face to face. Shaky. <laughs> You're too cute, sweetie. So yeah, I'm going to keep working on this bloody thing. Yeah. Help me uh, keep these birds safe. And it's not just these guys. It's every bird out there. There's dangers. And I still want to help those ones that uh, get surrendered and need a home. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do that. I don't know if they're going to let me help rehome them or at least give them better place to live. Something. Something. We've got to help those birds. Okay. Yeah. You're clicking at me. Okay. Say bye bye, darling. Oh, you're gonna climb. <laughs> Here's your little tail. Where's your tail? I'm gonna get you. Oh, what a mess. All right, everybody. Bye, Skip.